just finished Sunday training outside, outside of house, neighborhood. It's hot outside, I'm sweating, I'm happy, it's good. You know, today it's a Sunday, and, uh, but we're not stopping, we're still training, no days off. We're actually going fitness gym, I'm going to run and I'm going to swim there. So no day off, I don't care what day, it's Sunday or Monday, I'm still training, I'm, I'm coming, I'm training hard. I start my weight class today, I'm following a UFC nutritionist, so first time. I believe it's going to be much easier this time because um, I feel good already because I'm drinking, I'm eating a little bit uh, uh, smart way, not like my style and uh, I feel great. I think it's going to be good weight cuts for me. We are here at US Fitness Gym. We got to run, cut some weight. Nazim is with us. He has a big weight cut now, like last one. Come here, bro. Yeah. So, Naz we froze both. Yeah, Nazim has to weigh in tomorrow morning and he has a big weight cut now. I'm just starting my way cuts, I'm just gonna run and we have support here, teammates, brothers, friends and uh, hey, Matt, Matt, Matt. Yo, yo, what's up? Hello. <laughs> what's, what's your, what, what do you say about the, about uh, last, la, last night uh, competition? Oh, it was fun, yo, yeah, you know. We got to, I got to choke some dude, you know, and dart some guy, and then some Brazilian fucking arm barred me. So, you know, good, good times. <laughs> good times. Yeah, and Aljo, Aljo, whatever Aljo did, it was like a really gangster stuff. Because <laughs> he jumped, Aljo, jumped last, Aljo last second. He was, we would go for support match, for bola, and then, uh, and then Aljo ended up and uh, uh, do jujitsu match with. Middleweight guy, somebody black belt jujitsu. Aljo just rolled up and was like, "Give me the fucking toughest guy you got," and just fucked him up. Good. I run a lot at, at treadmill. It's good. Now feels like a weight cut. I feel good, but still, you know, running hard, not eating perfect. It's okay. It's a life, life. Our MMA fighters' life like this. You know? It's all good. Happy. I feel great. Very positive. I'm just focused on weight cuts. I have fun. I'm still in beautiful Vegas. I'm enjoying life, life is good. Even I'm hungry, life is good. Yeah, uh, like close sparring uh, for like uh, practice, like go smart, smart, close sparring, you know, like just visualize, fight. Okay, they have what you have CPI she. Zikosta netat. When we were the show, it's only the second big, it's the book, Lashoka Sweet Smell. Oh, hopefully I get more with the notes, we'll let you go. We've got this one again, so we can throw a record of she, as it is, and we can throw a record of she. 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 I have a few methods that I have to use in the same way. I have to use 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 the same way. 
when they told me I'm fighting Jose Aldo, I was so happy and so shocked and he was he was gonna fight with me and the UFC give me this fight. This is amazing. This is this is biggest fight in my career. Of course, uh, it's a huge fight, but it's it's like another fight for me. I don't know. I don't look as a something something special. I, I just take another fight. Doesn't matter what what name. I know everywhere is good and top UFC and especially of course he's been champion so many times. But um, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna show my best. You know, I'm just gonna go and then fight hard and show my best. You know, that's that's all I want. You know, I want to be best version of myself there. And I know I have a skill that I can beat him because the wrestling and grappling. Even he has a good good takedown defend. I will still make him tire, try take him down, keep fighting everywhere, wherever we go, clinch or strike or whatever, and then shoot again. This is my work for me, and it's gonna work for him too. <laughs> Crazy. I was sitting here five minutes and watch. That's all my sweat. Chemi Opli. Hutsu TV Jekiak. That's how it's so Chemi Opli. That's it. I should be more than my other shows. Papa, Gawi Hadut. Let's show everybody. Gawi Hadut, what you know. I'm going to put some of you down. Oh, 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 oh. This is good. <laughs> Stay there. Wow. Yes, you want to show this? Let's see now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make dry now and then let's check the weight how much I cut if I cut something because I drink before so let's see let's try so we're going now UFC PI our Georgian brother Amiran Gogoladze is fighting Denawit Contender Series on next Tuesday. And he came here by himself because they only give him visa, no no coaches has visa, nothing. He just came by himself. Lucky the Zuyad is was here and today he go help him to like translate like a, how to Photoshop like the interviews and stuff now i'm going there to see uh, so but tomorrow me and zuyad we have to go for my fight we have to be there utah so i'm in a google ads that has to be by himself like training cut weight like no coaches and then the butt he don't have also corner but me and zuyad we will be his corner but we will, after my fight hopefully i can walk and <laughs> i will come back and i will corner him but I, I know he's so strong and he will be UFC. I, I know he will finish his opponent and he will go UFC. Thank you. 
Soon, new UFC fighter will be from Georgia, and everybody will know his name. Amiran Kogoladze. He's he's warrior. He fights like a crazy guy. So it's, he always fights. He always brings the fight. This guy, Amiran Kogoladze, he's for example hard work because he's from a very small village. There is no MMA school. There is no wrestling school, but uh, he's. Uh, friend open little gym like little tiny room and they was training and he has only one good training partner like a big training partner not not even his side and then he was trained by himself a punching bag and and like this with and the training with the little kids and look at look at him now he's like professional fighter he amazing he he was winning fights other organizations like uh, but he's talented He's hardworking, and so small town from Georgia. He came all the way here, Vegas, and he's fighting. They know it can't take the serious, and I'm sure he will win this, and he will go UFC. But so it's like I said, everything is possible. <laughs>